Hi friends, welcome to Easy and Home Style Cooking. I'm Mrs. Ragini. Today I'm going to share a recipe with drumsticks, and this is so so yummy. I always sew yummy food only. So this is with boiled drumsticks. We are going to make a nice crispy drumstick. So here to make it very very simple, I have the boiled drumstick. So what I did is I have not peeled the skin too much, just little bit, and I boil it. And that too, if you see, it is not overcooked. It's perfectly cooked. Otherwise, your drumstick will be mashed. So don't overcook it. And here, we are going to put it in a plate. And this should be little bit wet. In this, we are going to add some cornmeal flour and rice flour, some turmeric, ginger garlic paste, coriander powder, some cumin powder. Whichever spices you want, you can just add it. And little bit extra chili powder, and mix this. Just mix it nicely so that this will coat to your drumsticks. And here the pan is hot. We are going to add some oil, not too much, just little bit. So, difference. Just add salt also. I forgot to add salt, so I added salt. And this was little bit dry, so you can just add some water so that this will become little more of liquid. Then this will stick nicely to our drumsticks. And here, if you see, the pan is also nice and hot. I added oil, and we are going to shallow fry this. You need not cook it too much. We just want nice crispiness. So friends, here you can see. Just let this sit for you know one minute, and then you can just you know turn it to the other side. See, if you try to rotate this immediately. Then the mixture will separate and your drumstick will separate. So, for little bit, let it cook, and then we'll get an excellent crispy, crispy drumstick. I'm going to cook this till we get a nice golden color. So, friends, here you can see how nice we got a golden color. And now we are going to put some curry leaves. If you want, you can just little bit chop it and add it in the same oil so that we'll get the curry leaves nice, crispy, crispy. And we can have the curry leaves also. Let this cook for another minute, and then we are going to switch off. So, friends, here you can see. After one minute, this is all ready. Even the curry leaves have cooked perfectly, and you can see drumsticks, nice brown color. And now switch off the flame, and just take a tong and arrange it onto a plate. You can serve it directly also. But if you see any excess oil, you know this is a better way. This you can just have it with sambar rice as a snack, or just like that also you can have. Try a little bit different, dear friends. So, dear friends, here my plate is done, and I cannot wait for this to go into my stomach. So, mm, hot, hot, but nice, crispy, crispy. I love to have whenever I have drumsticks, the entire drumstick. I'll put it in my mouth and chew it totally, and throw away the excess. This way, I love to have the drumsticks. If you love it, have it like this, and you will enjoy the drumstick. So, dear friends, I hope you enjoyed this simple, simple drumstick, crispy drumstick. This is very, very hot, so I'm going to have it later. So, see you in another session with some more recipes. That too, home style, and do share it with your friends and feed fresh food for your family.